at Phoenix Raceway, race day is a family affair. It, it's a great time to be out here with your children, and it's best when they're grown up and they're, they're going to with me to something that I like. It's really fun because you get to bond like with your family, and I like I like the sound. Gary and Blaine Hansen, among the generations of NASCAR fans taking in the Shriners Children's 500. It's an amazing feeling uh, growing up here in the infield, uh, now being able to bring him here in the infield and experience this. Kenny and Marley Miller flew in from California for the race. It means everything to us. This is our sideline hobby. Whether you're a seasoned fan or experiencing NASCAR for the first time, it's the people you go to the track with that are a bright part of the experience. Well, I'm an ex-racer myself, so you gotta love it. Camaraderie, the group, America, they're just out there. It's super cool. I knew it was gonna be like loud and stuff, but I didn't think it was gonna be like this good. Brandon and Addison Dickerson didn't know they'd be at the race until recently and have turned a first-time experience for each into a dad-daughter day they won't forget. Honestly, it was a last minute thing. A good friend of ours had some extra tickets and was willing to give it to us for the Sunday race. Uh, neither of us have ever been, so it's been a really neat experience to share as a daughter and a father. As Christopher Bell took home the win in front of a sold out crowd on a sunny Sunday at Phoenix Raceway, he's not the only one leaving the track a winner. It's just been fantastic, is all I can say. In Avondale, Zach Prolutsky for Arizona's family. Very